Hello, Internet! I'm Hamster Bob, and you are back for some more Metal Gear Solid 4! And... We're screwed! We're really screwed right now. This is bad. This is really bad. Okay, um... What we're probably gonna have to do... Oh, gosh. I mean, we picked up a lot of really awesome weapons last time. I don't think we should carry all of them just for the sake of... You know what, um... Though I might want to carry that. <laughs> um, might want to... Hideo Kojima's written on the cover. <laughs> but anyway... Um, we might want to carry this just in case we get to a point where we might want to distract somebody, because we have two silenced weapons, an attack weapon, and our knife, which I believe we're holding. Okay, stop. Let's... I think we want the operator, because right now we gotta kill. Now, um... Okay! We have to go over here. Our objective is, like, right there. Isn't it? It's right here to our right. Let's just go for it. I think this is it. Urgh! Oh, this is this it? No, this isn't it. Wait, wait. Why am I not there? Why am I not... My alert's going down. What? Oh, it's above me. Oh, is Sunny like changing positions every time? Okay, that's kind of cool. Okay, so. They're gonna make do. Let's stay in here until the alert goes down. Now we're in evasion. Okay. Alright. I think we're okay. Now, I didn't know that you could just pick things up. Oh, that rocket launcher is probably locked, now that I think about it. Okay, so. Evasion went down very quick, I'm glad. The last game, it was absurd how long it took. Okay, so the guys are all ahead, straight ahead. They are fighting each other. Ignore them. Okay. I think I can make my way to the ro- oh! This is so freaking lively! This game is unbelievable. I, I, like, I literally, I can't believe this game right now. Okay, everything is over there. I think we're safe to go. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Who's shooting at- Oh, hey, hey! Yes! Found a thing! Found a thing in a place. Place and a thing. What's this way? Is there anything that's... Something's beeping. I don't know what was beeping there. Hopefully we weren't, like, gonna get hit with a, a landmine of some sort. There's probably items and stuff that way. Oh, hey, hey! Got... I don't know what I got. 5.5... Maybe they're bullets. I don't know. Oh, this was just a roundabout way of getting back to where we already were. Well... That wasn't good, was it? We're gonna have to sneak by again. I'm assuming it's okay. Okay, now let's go up here. Um, assuming we got to uh, wait a second here. We got we gotta compose ourselves. Our objective really is over there to the left. That shortcut doesn't take us there. I'm assuming we gotta go up the stairs. Um, how to get there? I don't know. We gotta get to the other side so I can even see. Alright, let's go over here and I'll get a better look. Okay, yes. I think we gotta go upstairs. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Um, my health is actually regenerating over time, which is nice. Same for that other gauge, that psych gauge. It appears to be going up. Um, we should avoid this section. The control's a little weird. Oh, hey! Let's explore everything. Um, I hope it's not, like, hurting his back or anything by crouching so much, but, um, I really want to do it just because I... Oh, this was where we were in the beginning. Am I backtracking? I must be. No, I, I guess I'm not, or maybe this is where we were in that intro. But we, we got across here. I... I don't know what's going on. Like, why this isn't working. But, um, there's got to be another way in this building I'm not seeing if we are going into the building. Oh, maybe this will help. We got to go up. We gotta go up. Okay, no, never mind. And, uh, there's so much death and carnage. Oh, got a ration. Okay, well, cool. Um, that's, that's always nice. I really need to figure out some way to get on top of this building. You know, maybe it involves, um, taking this guy out, and if that's the case, um... I don't know, that was... Oh, right, 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 right. Man, these controls are weird. They're so different. Let's get over here. Right there. Headshot, right? Headshot. Yes. I did it. Oh, I did it. Oh, I freaking did it. Okay. Um, 
Let's keep everything up. That was our only target over here, correct? Whoa! Come here. Okay. Come here. Okay, um... Hold it tight, hold it tight. You know what, just get rid of it. Get rid of it. Just get rid of it. Take that. Oh shoot, those things are like... Those things are smart! Those things are freaking smart! Okay, not cool. Can I climb this? It's okay, I don't think anyone sees me anymore. Oh man. Okay, I can continue to explore the area, but the problem is I need, need to get to this point back here, and I don't understand why I am unable. It has nothing to do with that. Alright. Like, this this part's actually confusing me. I, like, I don't know where I'm really going here anymore. They are, like, live in gameplay doing things, too, so I can't just ignore them. Whoa. Close, close, close. Ooh. Gotta go over here, I guess. Maybe there's another way up. No. Sorry, but could you help me out? Sorry, man. I, um, next area. Where does it say that? Wait, next area. I tried to push triangle hoping I could do some. Next area. Why is it saying that? Oh. It was down. That whole time, I was looking around, and it was down. Wow. That was bad. Well, we got in here, though. It's pretty dark in there. Switch the solid eye to night vision mode. Oh, okay. Um, let's see. We, uh, push... Binoculars are over there. Okay, so... Got it. Ah! Wow, though. Dang. Okay. This solid eye thing is awesome. Cool. My head is, uh, exposed. Woo! He appears to be the only guy in here, though. I think we can take him out. I think we should just take him out. Where are you going? Which way are you going? That way. Got him! Okay. I, uh, didn't want to do that. I am trying to do more creative stuff in this game, but, um... No, it's this, right? It's- no, it's this. I, I gotta relearn my own controls. I'm used to the other Metal Gears. Um, I don't know if I should hide him. He appears to be the only guy down here. I think we'll be okay. I mainly wanted to get, yes, items out of him. A ration. Cool. Okay, that is helpful. Okay, now I don't know if there's gonna be mines or anything in here. That would stink. Okay, I would kind of think they would put them in here. Okay, um, maybe I should actually scout ahead with footprints? I'm leaving footprints. There's stuff up here too, I don't know what it is. I'm gonna crawl just in case, because I got a feeling that there's mines around here. They all above me? Don't move. Buddy there. Stay on your toes. There are guys, and they're all right here. <laughs> Get him! Oh. Shoot. No, 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 no. Wait, I got an idea. Oh, I need to shoot. I need to shoot. I need to- oh, I can't switch weapons, can I? Oh, no. Got you! Come on! Keep him up! Why can't I see? What's going on? What's going on? Why can't I see? What? What what happened with the solid eye? Did it like run out of battery or something? I don't know why it did that. Oh, it does have 
It has battery. I didn't know that. Oh no. Oh, okay. Okay. So. We need to be quiet. Is it gonna completely turn off? It's gonna completely turn off, isn't it? I got a new objective point, which is actually... Can I see? Anything? Oh, whoa. Oh. Oh, I see now. Okay, so I gotta go out here and take a right? But, what's straight? I don't know. According to this, though, that's where we're heading. Chickens? I love chickens! buck a buck ta buck buck box That was stupid. That was really stupid. That was really stupid. That was really stupid. Oh, that was really stupid. Yeah. Solid Eye's gone. Solid Eye is gone. It's recharging. I didn't know it worked like that. Oh, they use the same battery system? Okay, um, you know what? Um, we haven't done it yet. Let's send out some Kodak calls. Like, why not? I'm assuming we can only talk to Otacon? Snake. The PMC soldiers are using ID guns. Yeah. ID guns. See how the word locked appears in the weapon list? Yeah. ID guns are equipped with locks. As long as the lock is engaged, you can't pull the trigger. Any suggestions? The locks are only disengaged when they recognize the nanomachine ID inside a soldier's body. Anyone not possessing nanomachines keyed to the system, or anyone who's keyed but not authorized to use that weapon, won't be able to pass the ID guns verification process. Hmm. So I can't use PMC guns. I'm afraid not. You're not registered with the system. Hmm. And it's not just weapons either. Vehicles, buildings, everything used for military purposes is secured with this oh. ID control system. Without the proper IDs, it's impossible for PMCs or state armies to fight. Wow. Think of it as a soldier's dog tag, only at the nano level. So... I shouldn't even bother picking up ID guns. For now, at least. But they might come in handy later on. Oh, they might, but I mean... I, I shouldn't bother. Snake, if you find there's not enough light to see with the naked eye, you can always use the solid eyes night vision mode. I sound like I shouldn't use it at all, though. Head for the building where our informants are waiting. Right. Your radar will show you which way to go. The radar better not run out of battery. Snake, you need to rendezvous with our informants. They're U.S. Special Forces. If you need to know which way to go, check your radar. Okay. I know sometimes you really gotta spam the codec to get some Head interesting the stuff. Where our informants are. Sounds like not. Okay. Got it. So, um... Hey, they need reinforcements up top. You ready to roll? Yeah, I'm good. Great. Let's go! Right behind you. They're running around me. Okay. What's this guy doing? Is he okay? I don't I don't want to alert him. I just just leave him alone. Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Yeah, they are This is a bad bad place to be. Um it's another pistol. I don't He says not to bother, but What's going on in here? Damn it. Where are those freaks? What's that? Shoot. Four. Weird looking. Four weird looking. What are you talking about? Pentezamine. Something wasn't human. I'm trying to listen to them. Oh shoot. Let's get this. Let's get out of here. I I uh What's that? Oh great. A theme of terror, the original uh, Metal Gear infiltration music. Oh, okay, that's awesome, but um 
I guess that's for my iPod. Shoot. What do we do? There's a guy up here who thinks he saw something. There's so many lights! I can't see where these guys are. Like, I really don't know where I'm going anymore. Let me let me check this again. Um, there's so... M Whoa, okay. Yeah, we're going up here to the left. Man, I don't even see our objective... Oh, gosh, it's so far up. <laughs> we're going so far up. Okay. You just gotta be quiet. Everyone is out to kill us. I don't know what that is. I got it. <gasps> okay, um... Ah, uh, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna take him. Huh. The enemy's here. <laughs> Dang it, I tried to hold him up. Whoa! <laughs> Boom! Knock him down. What is that? No, what is that? It's like a wing! Okay, um, um, should we hide? Should we hide? Fortunately, Snake seems to be okay. Alright, cool. Now we're in evasion. Let's just keep going. Wait. That's a box. That's a box. That is a box. That, my friend, is a cardboard box. Oh, okay. Ordinary cardboard box. Hide the enemies. Oh, I want... Hey. Nope! No, I got you first! I got you first! I got you first! Boom! Alright, now, um, give me your things, and time to go. Okay, um, let's get that, like, immediately. Uh, actually, I haven't used the Mark II yet at all, but it's okay. Um, I'm assuming the iPod is mainly just for fun. We don't need to mess with that yet. Um, the weapons, though, I think we just have a bunch of locked stuff, do we not? Um, I can't really tell what I have able to use and what I don't. So, oh well, camouflage. Wait. Oh, wow, what is this? Iron camo. Okay, it's a it's a cloth. I didn't know you could change this. Uh, chest khaki. Okay, octa camo. Auto. Right. And, um, khaki. Olive dr Oh my gosh, you change this? Do I have to change that all the time? Or is that just preference? Hoping it matters. Oh gosh, okay. What's that beeping? Uh... Wait, what's that? A disguise. Oh! Clothes for disguising Snake is a local Middle Eastern militiaman. You can put them on by select... Hey, then I another I got another magazine and whoa get in here okay oh my the solid eye burns battery so fast oh my gosh like mmm I hope it's not that radar I really hope it isn't because if I take this off do I not have my radar anymore ration yeah you lose your radar Okay, um, I can't do anything in here. Um, shoot. Should we crouch? Oh, you can't even crouch anymore. Okay, hopefully that buffs our camo a bit. Um, I'm not sure where we're going around here. We can hold seven rations, which is nice. Um... Wait, wait, our disguise. I want our disguise. Um, how do we wear that? Um, I'm assuming it is in here. Because that's where it used to be. It used to be an item, but it might actually be in camouflage. Concrete camo. Change costume to disguise. Wait, is that our old disguise, or is that... Is this... 
I think that's what they just told me, what, right? It was the militiamen thing? Um, I think it is. I hope so. Oh good, I can do both at once. I don't know if I want to be in a box right now. Boxes move. Boxes move. Maybe that's why I wasn't getting shot at before, because of my disguise. I hope it works. Oh, it did! It worked! It's working! Now, just to make sure we're going the right way. Oh, okay. We're gonna go up here. Yes, we're going the right direction. Oh, I feel so much safer now. Which is probably a bad thing. You don't want me to feel safe. I'm assuming they can't look at me in the face. Now, if we find these PMC guys, which they look different, we gotta take them out no matter what. You. That's fine. Ah! You hit me, man. Just looking for goodies. Just looking for goodies. Fortunately, they're not, like, distracted. Because before... Oh, do I even have to hold, like, a certain weapon or anything? They're just okay with... Got RPG ammo. It doesn't matter. I can't shoot it, but... We got it. In case we get the ability to unlock stuff, we have that. That's nice. Really nice. Are we getting near our uh, destination? Oh gosh. This. Oh, everything going on. Oh, this room looks like it's built for a firefight. Because I bet you all that stuff moves. Got. Anesthesia? I assume, or something like that. Can I eat the. Can I eat mice? I mean, I'm getting a little hungry. Oh, that is our next area. Yes. Hope we can find our, uh, our guys pretty soon. Hopefully, this is them. I hope so. I hope I did a good job of getting enough stuff there. I'm, I'm pretty content with what we found. A lot of the stuff is locked, which is a shame, but we did get this really awesome disguise. Mmm, that's probably why we were doing a lot better in the beginning, because people were like, oh, you're good. I don't know what's the difference between this and the Octocamo. I have you. Don't touch it. We have enough. We have plenty. Snake, we have plenty. It's okay. What the heck is that? What is that? What is this? My precious in my underwear. Pretty sweet, huh? huh? Is it like a what? Oh, hold it. Watch where you're pointing that thing. It sounds like Signet. Is it re Who are you? Is it Signet? Neither enemy nor friend. Voila. You're not with the militia, and you're not PMC. I'm a weapons wholesaler. All shapes, all sizes. But there's no need to worry, because all my shit's been laundered. Laundered? <laughs> it's like a magician, but he's also a black market dealer? Take ID guns like the PMCs use and make some mods. Then you can use them without having to match IDs. In other words, I'm a gun launderer. You can call me Drebin. 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 Yeah. They use that for all. His voice sounded like Sigma before I got excited. All over the world. Not that I ever met any of them personally. Me, I'm Drebin number 893. Huh. Okay. But I I don't have you money or anything. PMC employee. Hi. <laughs> you need a guy like me. Kinda do, actually. Consider the welcome you. Take it. Snake's not a really trusting guy, eh? I hope this is okay. The official carbine model used by the U.S. Army. That's right. From the M16. Metal Gear 2. That's right. This one's a top of the line model. Real popular with the big PMCs. High precision. Not like that government issue shit. It's, uh, 
Free floating, of course. Relax. That barrel's clean. Hmm. Is the Hyder CQC compatible? The beauty of this sucker is that it's got a lot of customizable parts. Change it up the way you want to meet your everyday needs. Flip up huh. sight, rail system. Not bad. You can actually Where's customize the gun? I get a lot of noobs around here. And if you need them, I got a wide selection of aftermarket parts as well. The frame's pretty rigid. No rattle. Go ahead. Give her a squeeze. Hmm. Huh. I can't pull the trigger. Really? That's weird. My That's psych weird. went down. Why'd okay. my psych go down? I got it. I bet you're using an older generation of nano machines. Older generation? Sometimes they don't really jive with the new system. Seriously, who are you? Oh, slow down. It actually stressed him out <clears throat> trying to pull that trigger. My like day job's working at AT Security. I'm in charge of production control. Uh oh. So I get my hands on all the ID chips before they even register. Have a sit. Mm -hmm. It's a side of AT the public don't see. From the looks of it, you ain't with any state army. But you ain't exactly green, neither. You've got last gen nano machines. So I'm guessing former US Army. <laughs> I don't know what you're here for. But you want to be well equipped, am I right? So, can we talk business or what? You won't regret it. Oh, I don't know about this guy. I do not know about this guy. What's your take on Emoticon? I don't particularly like the guy. But it looks like we'll need his help with those ID guns. Sonny's been doing a little sleuthing for us. Drebin, a well-known gun launderer in war economy circles. Hmm. He's a businessman who deals mainly in selling black market firearms to small PMCs and local militia. Somalia, the Balkans, Lebanon, Darfur, Chechnya, Timor, Peru, the Punjab, Kashmir, Colombia. This guy really gets around. Dang. How's he pull it off anyway? You can create a non-ID gun by replacing the ID recognition chip with a counterfeit version. This enables you to bypass the ID recognition process and use the gun. The problem is that there's still a record of the chip being replaced on the system side. Hmm. Drebin's an employee of AT Security. He must have connections on the inside erasing records for him. You think the Patriots are involved somehow? I'm not so sure. If the Patriots were running the system from behind the scenes, then a weasel like Drebin would be a real pain in their collective ass. Can he be trusted? Remember, mm. Drebin's a green collar. He makes his living off the war economy. Huh. He doesn't let emotions get in the way of business, and he never gets his own hands dirty. The only thing he trusts is money. I share your concern, but what if we keep him at arm's length? Use him only to get intel and the supplies we need. Keep it strictly business. All right. I guess we don't really have much of a choice. So, as I can see. We ready to make a deal or what? His monkey is creepy. Okay then, let's talk business. This is a war zone. There's product coming in here by the truckload. And you'll be picking up a lot of guns in the field, I'm sure. What's in the box? Whatever guns you don't need, I'll take and buy them off you. That'll earn you points you can cash in for services. Like what? I'll launder your ID guns. No more locks. And I can also sell you the guns I've got in stock. Let me show you. So I gotta give up guns that we can't use yet. Probably the RPG is for that, because I doubt we can have that already. Oh. This is starting to seem very, very customizable. Whoa. Wait, what? I wanted to see all that. I did. I told you I was going to try and figure out how to pause, sure but I forget. -ID guns, I'd rather not. I'm going to have to suppress the old nano machines you got in you. 
Otherwise, they'll interfere with the system. Here, stick yourself with this. Uh, it's full of suppressor nano machines. Relax, it won't hurt. I don't know if that's a good idea. You're scared of needles or something? That thing too. See, no sweat. Maybe I'm not now supposed to be wearing it. ID guns, no problem. Remember, because we chose to wear this. Hey, be nice to our kids. Step outside. What is it with the shaved um monkey? Is he sharing his apple? Oh. up an ID gun that says lock hmm. you just let me know you name it I can launder it of course it'll cost you the going rate depends on the war price at the time hmm <clears throat> which means I should buy things while they're cheap and I gotta give this shit a rest looks like you're doing pretty well for yourself you might say that what with the war economy and all and the system clamping down on things. System codes are the law now, and control's essentially absolute, paving the way for fat profits, if you're willing to bend the law. The man keeps on growing thanks to the war economy. I sell ID guns to the PMCs and state armies, and naked guns to terrorist groups and paramilitaries. And these ID guns can't be sold on the black market. System's practically a license for us arms dealers to print money. Privatizing the military has made the PMCs big and bloated. The fatter the PMCs get, the line between civilian and soldier is gonna get real blurry. Hmm. Sooner or later, the whole damn human race is gonna be green collars. More like we're all gonna be fighting proxy wars. But hey, this war economy puts the food on my table. You're a green collar too, aren't you? Yeah, it's in your eyes. You've seen a lot of combat. What makes you think you know me? Nothing to be ashamed of. I'm the same way. I grew up here too. I got no interest in the outside world. All right then. If you need me, holla. We specialize in speedy oh. service. Catch my drift. Do I Kodak call him? It's weird, like, how would he actually have enough people to sell to? I don't know, I guess he's, he's right, because civilian and soldier are becoming the same thing. In the end, you really do need to sell to the civilian. Were these all rendered with, like, every costume possible? Was I supposed to find that thing? Because this is... It's really helping now that we have this. But anyway. We really need to meet up with those guys, remember? Friends of ours. Oh, great! Back into this nonsense! I think so, but either way, like, it's been a really long episode. Well, sort of long. It's been pretty long. We should probably end it. Okay, but. Just making sure we can actually get back into our gameplay first. I know what you're thinking, but Drebin does have a point. The world depends on war, on the war economy. Can you imagine what would happen if war just disappeared overnight? Otacon, you and Drebin both mentioned something about a war price earlier. What did you mean by that? It's a kind of market price. 
one that fluctuates according to demand, not only for PMCs and military industry, but for the production, distribution, and energy supply networks that support them. Hmm. It's been growing by leaps and bounds, and investors are really starting to take notice. As the fighting in any given area becomes increasingly intense and prolonged, the war price goes up. Oh. No doubt Drebin's rates are linked to that war price. The longer and bloodier a battle becomes, the higher service prices are going to get. Oh. And to put it another way, the quieter things are, the better the bargains. Snake, we'll use the Mark II to deal with Drebin from here on out. He's what you might call a street vendor. The Mark II can act as a kind of delivery boy and connect you with him. Okay. I'm adding a Drebin menu item to the Mark II's weapon menu. Whenever you pick up multiple units of the same weapon, any extras will automatically be sold to Drebin. Okay. Any ammo that's inside gets added to your cash. In other words, you keep the ammo, and the weapon itself gets traded to Drebin for points. I see. Hmm. You can then use the points you've earned to unlock ID guns or buy new weapons. Hmm. Sounds good. We should assume Drebin has other agents collecting guns for him besides you, Snake. Right. You know, freelance green collars who collect weapons in exchange for services? Guess I'll have to rely on him for now. Okay. Now go meet up with our informants. Rat Patrol. Right. M4 Custom. Oh, wow. Dang. Now we got that. And, uh, oh my gosh. We're once again dropped somewhere in the middle of all of this craziness. And it is going to have to wait for the next episode. So thank you all so much for watching, and remember to like the videos and subscribe for more, and I will see you all in the next episode of Metal Gear Solid 4. Boop.